we've all heard of flying standby, whether it's from a friend that works for an airline or over the airport speaker system. My name is Haley from Better Wander, and today I'm going to be giving you a few tips on how to fly standby. If you don't know what standby flying is, it's basically what airline employees use to fly for free, or if you're lucky enough to have a buddy pass through an airline employee, you can also use it to fly for free. Normal folk that don't have an airline employee around, you can use it for catching another flight if your flight gets delayed, or if you decide you wanna catch an earlier flight, they might put you on standby. There is no guarantee that you're going to get on a flight flying standby. It just means that if there are available seats on your desired flight, you can then get on. So here are a few tips to help you if you find yourself ever wanting to or needing to fly standby. First, you're gonna to need to make sure that your ticket even allows you to fly standby. All right, so I have opened up this hypothetical situation on Google Flights because that is what I like to use. So we're going to New York July 1st, leaving this time, coming back this time. And you're gonna scroll down here to this fare options. And this will tell you if you can fly standby right here. And it says free change possible fare difference. That means that you can fly standby right there. Second, you're gonna to wanna to carry on your luggage. It's less likely to get lost in transit or just never get on your plane because you're gonna be jumping around from gate to gate most likely. You are also going to wanna to apply for standby as soon as possible because flying standby is handled on a first come first serve basis. It also helps if you are part of the loyalty or rewards program and you're stacked up on there because airlines like loyalty <laughs> and you're more likely to get on a flight that way. Once all of that is checked off, make sure you are at your gate on time, if not early, because if they call your name for standby and you are not there, they're moving on to the next person and you're out of luck. Most of all, you need to remember to be patient because Flying standby is no guarantee. They are accommodating to you, so you may have to wait around a little bit to get that flight that you're wanting. But if you're a last minute person like me, it may be worth it to you. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe because we have a lot of awesome stuff.